you so much for joining me today. Uh, my name is Matthew. I'm on the education team for Polite. I am here with Jen from Dockside Ballard, uh, and she is our Bud Tender Spotlight of the Month. Uh, we always like to uh, shout out and highlight Bud Tenders from around the state of Washington. Um, again, because we, we can't really fulfill our mission of, of helping people with, with cannabinoid products without butt tenders, um, doing the research, doing the education, and, and getting our products into people's hands. Um, so, Jen, welcome. Thank you so much for joining us today. Um, you know, again, thank you so much for, for the work you guys and everyone at Dockside does. Um, an incredible team, very medically focused and driven, and, and that's uh, something that we really appreciate. Thank you. Um, so uh, we'll get started. Um, what got you interested in joining the cannabis industry? Uh, so I came from a medically oriented background. Uh, I used to work 911 services as an EMT. Oh, wow. So it was something that from going to something that was just kind of go, go, go to something that was much more relaxed and where I was kind of able to talk to people and get to know them a little bit better and experience their stories too. Yeah. Uh, it's definitely a transition though. <laughs> Absolutely. Uh, kind of just marrying my, my desire to help people and to kind of keep um, my interest in plant medicine going. Um, so it was just a really great experience and really good timing. Yeah. Oh, that's awesome. Um, is, is your job at Dockside your first job in the cannabis industry? Uh, no, I've been attending for quite some time, but it is my first time being a medical consultant, awesome. which is definitely a new layer to what it's like to being a butt tender. Yeah, absolutely. I, I was a medical consultant for years and it definitely adds, you know, another level to it and, and that interaction and communication you got to have with, with the customers. Yeah. Sure. Um, what, what would you say is the most rewarding part of working, um, you know, as a consultant? Uh, definitely finding that one product for somebody who, you know, it's a lot of trial and error, which is an unfortunate part of it, but it can also be very rewarding too for that moment that you find that one product that a lot of times lately too, it's been polite products that awesome. just, that tends to just really hit the mark that that person's been looking for for so long. Awesome. I'm so glad to hear that. Um, what do you think people uh, think about products like Polite that are kind of intentionally lower in THC? Uh, I think they're received kind of two different ways uh, by the community that's much more oriented towards, I need the highest cannabinoids to make any kind of effect. Definitely a different reception than folks that are maybe a little bit more intimidated. But sure. I think that when both of those communities try these type of products, they're both in for a very different experience. That we don't always need the highest THC to make a to make a huge difference in what we're looking for. Sometimes it's being an advocate for the entirety of the plant that makes the I'd say the heaviest impact. That's so awesome. Yeah, that was something, um, you know, I, I personally found is that there's a lot of people that just think, oh, I only need or want THC. But like you, you're saying, they're missing out on a lot of other aspects and components from the plant. Exactly. Like I, one of the coolest things is seeing CBG kind of come into its own spotlight these days, too. Yeah, absolutely. Um, yeah, and, and exactly. The more we, we learn and the better the growers get and the extractors get, we're just going to have access to so many more new components. Very exciting. Um, so, so you were saying that uh, Polite products have, have been helping people. Um, what is some of the feedback that you've gotten uh, from customers using Polite products? Uh, I think a lot of people are really excited for the, the dose in particular, myself included. Um, I personally look for something with a higher CBD dose and Polite products have been everything that I personally have been looking for. And it's nice to share that excitement with some of our patients and our customers too. Um, finding stuff that has such a high CBG count has been really exciting and seeing how different those products can be to the products that we're more accustomed to seeing. Absolutely. Oh, that's awesome. Uh, you were saying that your your job at Dockside is the first time you've been uh, a medical consultant. Um, what would you say is kind of unique about Dockside and the team that you guys have there? Uh, Dockside has a lot to offer. 
uh, there are a lot of people with a lot of different life experiences and a lot of different opinions on what they see being the most helpful in their particular smoking regimens. And from using those particular experiences, I myself have learned a lot more. Um, I've learned that I've learned all different aspects of cannabis to be 100% with you. That walking in somewhere and seeing that they have a library of books has been an absolute game changer for me. It's the thing that I knew I wanted to be at Dockside was how heavy education is emphasized there. Yeah, that's awesome. Well, thank you so much um, for joining us today. Thank you so much for, for the work that you do at Dockside. Um, we, again, we really appreciate uh, everything that you guys do that goes above and beyond in, in helping and supporting the medical community. Yeah, thank you guys. It's been great having Polite.